A lot of people that I used to get high with are dead. Oh, it's crazy. Wouldn't have known. Wouldn't have guessed. <laughs> really? Thanks. <laughs> that means a lot to me. Yeah, definitely not. Because there used to be a time when you'd be like, oh, that girl used to get high a lot. <laughs> no, <laughs> you know? right. I started using drugs and alcohol um, when I was about 14. And right away, right away, it, it was just off the chain. It was just off the deep end, way overboard with uh, the drug and alcohol use. But for whatever reason, it just made me comfortable like to drink and use like that. Yeah, so I used a lot of needles, and I overdosed, and ended up, yeah, ended up like like an ambulance took me to the hospital. And crazy. I remember laying in that hospital bed, and I was just like, God, if you get me out of here, I swear I will never drink or use anything ever again. And uh, I got out of that hospital bed. You know, they discharged me a few hours later, and it wasn't even a full day, and I was drinking and using it again. Like, I just could not stay clean. I could not figure out how to stay clean. And that's when I realized I really, really, really needed help. I got totally clean and sober. I was, like, going to meetings all the time. and. Um, one day, like, a bunch of my friends were drinking, and I was like, maybe, maybe I'm not really that bad. Like, maybe I was just young. You know, I was like 26 right. mm -hmm. or 25, I think, at that point. And I was like, yeah, I haven't, I never even had a legal drink. Like, I quit drinking before uh, I was even 21, you know? Right. I relapsed, and I started drinking and using again. And um, I got kicked out of nursing school because of it. Uh, I was like a year away from getting my bachelor's. I was so uh, close. That was like the beginning of the end. I drank and used for a few years after that, and that's when I met Joe. And when I met Joe is when I really, really changed my life around.